Today we're going to be talking about probability. Probability is the likelihood that something will happen, or what are the chances something will happen. You can measure probability on a continuum. Things can happen never or be impossible, all the way up to be absolutely 100% certain that they absolutely will happen. Now very few things in life will absolutely never happen, or 100% always happen. Most things are possible and fall somewhere along here on our number line. If there's an equal chance of it happening or not happening, we would call it 50-50, or it's equally likely that it will or will not happen. Things on this side of the number line probably won't happen. There's lots of different ways of describing that. You could say it's unlikely, it's improbable, not likely, or it probably won't happen. Things on this side of the number line are more likely to happen than not happen. So we would say they are likely to happen, they are probable, they probably will happen, or there's a good chance. Let's think of some examples for each one of these. Something that is impossible or never will happen would be rolling a 7 on a die. There's only the numbers 1 through 6. It is impossible for you to get a 7 with just one die. Another thing that's impossible or will never happen would be a purple cow flying by in our classroom in the middle of the night. It's just not going to happen. So these would be the things that we would say never will happen, are impossible, or there's a 0% chance. On the other side of the continuum is if something is certain or at 100% will happen or absolutely will happen. Again, very few things end up on this side of the continuum. If you had a spinner for a game that was all red, you could say that you are certain that when you spin that spinner, assuming nothing happens to the spinner, that you will land on red. Um, assuming that you continue to live, you can be certain that you will take a breath within the next three hours. So again, very few things are certain, absolutely 100% will happen. Most things are going to fall out along here. If it's cloudy and the weather conditions are right, you could say it's 50-50 whether or not it's going to rain. If you're flipping a coin, you could say it's equally likely that you get a heads or you get a tails. If you are alive tomorrow, we could say that it's probable or likely that you're going to eat lunch at some point. There's a good chance that you are going to learn how to add or subtract in school. On this side, we could say it is unlikely that you will get three ice cream parties in one day. We could say that it is not likely that if you roll a dice a hundred times that you will get the number one 99 of those times. So again, there's a continuum here where it goes from never happening all the way up to always happening, and each event in life can fall somewhere along this. Can you think of something that is absolutely impossible? It's probably a little challenging because, like I said, most of the time, there's a small chance that it might be able to happen. Can you think of something that is absolutely 100% certain that it will happen? Again, it's probably a little challenging to think of something because you're always wondering, well, what if this happens? So not many things are impossible or certain. Most likely, it's going to land somewhere along here. Think of something that probably will happen. That would fall out somewhere on this side of our number line. Can you think of something that's unlikely it's not going to happen most likely? That would fall somewhere over here. And last but not least, can you think of something where it's a 50-50 chance? It either will or it will not, and there's no bias towards one side or the other. That would land right here in the middle where there's an equal chance that it will or will not. Pay attention to these words because they come up a lot in life and they determine the probability, the chances that something will happen.